It was an operational challenge of Olympic proportions. More airplanes, more people, more luggage. All with the eyes of the world watching us. But in the end, the Vancouver International Airport team turned in a gold medal performance at the 2010 Games. Here's how we did it. From the beginning, YVR made partnerships the backbone of our Olympic operations plan. We met with previous Olympic host airports to gain knowledge from their experience and to identify the many operational issues that the Games would present. Some of the challenges were obvious ones, such as how to handle the massive volume of travelers and baggage all arriving at YVR at the same time. More complicated were the additional security issues, airspace restrictions and aircraft parking, not to mention language and cultural liaison, international media requirements, heads of state, VIPs and crowd control. Complex problems like these require integrated solutions. From day one, Vancouver Airport Authority brought all the partners together, air carriers and commercial operators, VANOC, CATSA and US and Canada Border Services, emergency services, RCMP, retailers and customer service providers to weave an integrated operational plan that would ensure a seamless, safe and efficient experience for all travelers during games time. While the games themselves would only run for a few weeks, YVR began training for them almost three years in advance. Training sessions helped YVR staff get their game faces on. Peer reviews gave the opportunity to share best practices and develop role-playing scenarios. In 2009, test events like the World Police and Fire Games and a dry run at the Sea Island Remote Terminal Facility, built for Olympic departures, ensured that our systems and our people were fully prepared. Through our research, we learned that athletes travel with five to seven pieces of luggage, much of it oversized, overweight, or difficult to handle with conventional baggage carts. So one of YVR's enterprising teams solved the problem by creating a brand new cart, specially designed to handle large, unwieldy items like skis, customized wheelchairs, and hockey equipment. It's just one of many examples of proactive, innovative thinking by the YVR team to create a positive games time experience for our guests. They began arriving in January from every corner of the globe, by commercial carrier, charter, and private aircraft. Everything from airbuses to Aleutians, hitting a peak on February 11th, the day before the opening ceremony. The Joint Olympic Coordination Center, or JOC as it became known, was the heart of YVR's Olympic operations. Daily 7 a.m. briefings were held with every stakeholder group at the table. Potential bottlenecks were discussed and resources deployed accordingly to get ahead of issues before they became problems. With the daily information sheet in hand, it was over to our extended team to make it all happen. Every person in every department played a vital part in delivering an outstanding visitor experience, with YVR staff seconded to customer care and Olympic coordination roles. Baggage handlers used airside wheelchair lift elevators to move the huge volume of wheelchairs and other equipment for the Paralympic teams. Volunteers were critical to our success. A team of over 400 green coats helped guests with directions, connections, ticketing information, and any one of a thousand other requests. Inside the terminal, musicians, live sculptures, and wandering performance artists kept travelers entertained. Over the games period, YVR hosted 2.6 million passengers handled 2.7 million bags and 29,000 flights. The Vancouver 2010 Olympic and Paralympic Winter Games gave Canada and YVR a chance to show our best to the world. Here's the five secrets of our success. We planned early and had a vision. We practiced, practiced, practiced. We encouraged innovation and excitement. We recognized team achievements regularly. And most importantly, we built partnerships and engaged early and engaged often. With strong leadership and integrated teamwork, and drawing on the passion and talents of our team, YVR provided an exceptional experience for every athlete, coach, sponsor, friend and fan at the Vancouver 2010 Winter Games.
Well, a great insight into the teamwork that characterized the YVR's Olympic effort uh, here. Well, finally, I would like to take a moment and sincerely thank uh, Graham Clark personally and on behalf of the Airport Authority's employees for the vision and leadership he has provided as chair. The YVR we all admire today is very much a product of Graham's dedication. Thank you, Graham. Thank you.